Welcome back to ESPN's Around the Horn. I'm Tony Reale. With us is Bill Plaschke. I had to break for an iguana today in the freeway. You know what that means? A 25% chance of rain. You need a plash course in statistics. Tim Kalashaw. The name show. Kalashaw. There's a Kalashaw and Connery impression. Kevin Blackstone. Appreciation, Tony. Arg, I just pirated your right to speak, Black Beardstone. And Woody Page. My first grade teacher was a junkyard dog named Tessa. We start with guns. Mav Center Chris Kamen asks, what about people's rights in regard to the current gun control debate? What do you think about his comments? 91% uh, of me isn't sure which white center Chris Kamen is. 5% of me is hungry. And 4% of me doesn't own a radio. Flashing response. I'll take some callous law with my burger. On this team, we tear ourselves and everybody else to pieces for that comment. Black snake mode. Chris came in to show you there. We have live footage of around the horn zone, Jay Mariotti trying to escape from the San Quentin prison. What are you doing, Mariotti, queen of Scots? The guards didn't give me a fruit cup, so I took a hostage. Chris Kamen should give me his guns. Felons can't own guns, contrariati to popular belief. Don't kill anyone. Coulda, woulda, shoulda. I love the third Bourne movie, but the ending gave me gas. That's Matt Damon. We're talking about Chris Kamen. I don't like impersonators. Next question. Should the national debate on gun control extend to athletes? Athletes own 27% of the guns owned by athletes. Clearly they should be talking to their guns, Tony. There's bad information on your flash drive. E. coli bacteria! Welcome to the jungle! And the jungle's full of guns! Hey, that wasn't Prince. I think it was James Brown. <laughs> Black is stony soprano. Ethies enjoy privilege. Your blackophone is in a tunnel of breaking news. Mariotto von Bismarck. Stay back or I'll paint these walls red. Oh, hi, Tony. Why do we care? I'm making history right now. And you want to talk about Chris f***ing <laughs> Cayman? I'll give him something to talk about. So I Mariotti an axe murderer. Parsley Page, Rosemary, and Time. We need to re-examine the national discussion on sporks. It's a fork with the soul of a spoon. I know why the Page Bird sings. He likes sporks. If you could ask lawmakers one question, what would it be? Canadian baller, Steve Plash. 86% of new bills are written in Time's New Roman. Now that font hurts my eyes, so I don't concern myself with Johnny Law. Checking out, I see. Let's hope for a cowl of Shawshank Redemption. I don't speak platypus, Agent C. You're pitching a perfect game of silence, David Blackacone. I'd ask if the right to life is more sacred than the right. Sorry to cut off your black a droning on. Oh wait, no I'm not. Tooth? Very oddy. Nice digs, huh? I switched clothes with a, uh, <clears throat> retired guard. <laughs> I'd ask the lawmen if they liked the booby traps I set when they came looking for me. I bet the first four in didn't. Don't care how many people you hurt, you're still the best this show has got. Johnny B. Woody Page. I'd ask him how much a child's smile is worth. Then I'd ask him if the phrase eat your cool and mammal means anything to him. Cause if it does, then you're in for a world of lizard people hurt. Are automatic weapons too much defense for free agent citizens? Hands in the air and empty the flash register. Automatic weapons prevent 65% of burglars from buying handguns. Now, the best defense is a good offense. That's why you should use an anti-tank gun to counter a burglar's Uzi. You might lose your house. I've got a cow lick and it won't go down. Well... Whoa, you can't do that! Who are you even supposed to be? Walt Disney! <laughs> Super Kalashala Fragilistic XBL... Sorry, NAACP. Kevin Blackstone talks so we don't get hate mail. Uh, I'll take the hate mail. The best exotic Mariotti Gold Hotel. Too much firepower in the wrong hands is dangerous. Ask California Governor Jerry Brown. I'm underneath his house right now with a buttload of homemade C4, and the only thing that can save his dogs is a full pardon. There's one more slug in the 12-page shotgun. Man needs neither gun nor bullet if he speaks the language of the Wolverine. Ah, the sword got stuck in the blackest stone this round, and King Arthur was nowhere to help. We'll be back with more Around the Horn after the break. You can pry my cold, dead hands from my cold, dead hands!